As I am a second year university student, I feel like I have definitely had my fair share of stress over the past couple of years. So I thought I'd make a little video talking about ways that I personally find help to deal with this and just to, you know, make life a lot easier. I would like to stress I'm not a doctor or trained or anything like that. that is, th these are just literally things that I have done which I found make life so much easier. So I would like to share this wisdom with you lovely people on the internet. Oh, actually though, before we begin, I would like to just take a moment to appreciate my socks, which are in fact bubbles from the Powerpuff Girls. Anyway, number one thing that I found that you can do is to drink water. I don't know science and stuff, but I know that water is just, you know, really great for you anyway, and it is so, so good for your brain especially, so if you are coming up to deadlines and you've got lots of work to do, or you've got an exam to advise for, and basically you just need to get down on your work, water is the best thing you could possibly drink. Even squash, like, which you would think would be, you know, it's it's pretty much water but flavoured. Even that, it's just got loads of crap in it, so you want to just just drink water as much as you can. <laughs> it's so important to make sure you get enough sleep. If you are one of these people, particularly, who is just sort of cramming and constantly and they feel bad or they, they feel like they should be revising at any time that they're not, you need to chill. Make sure you get at least eight hours sleep. Again, not a doctor, that's just, you know, what people say, eight hours is a good amount. So make, make sure you get enough sleep, whatever is good for you, so you're not yawning and tired because it's just, I mean, it's just not going to go in if you have to do some work or, I mean, say you're revising for some exam and you're just cramming and you're tired, it's, your brain is just not going to take it in, it's not going to work, so it's not beneficial for you or your grades. Likewise, try and make sure that you don't mess up your sleeping pattern too much. If you are sleeping all day and you're awake all night, even if you are awake a good amount of hours and asleep a good amount of hours, if you're just looking out the window and it's dark, that is not going to motivate you because I know personally myself, I need to make sure I get up at a decent time and I see the glorious sun shining and I'm like, right, I am going to get stuff done today. Whereas on days where I lay in and I just sort of feel a bit, ugh, then nothing gets done and it just doesn't work. Another really completely doable way to make sure that you are not stressing out is to eat properly. This might sound again incredibly obvious such as all of the things that I'm doing but it's so easy to not do them like I know if I can't bother to cook I will be so tempted to literally go to McDonald's because for me it's about a 10 minute walk up the road <laughs> or to just sort of microwave some really bad meal that doesn't leave you feeling full or it, it's just not good. <laughs> if you are putting crap into your system then that's all your body has to work with and it's just going to make you even more so just get in all those veggies and those green foods they are just great for you. The next thing I found is to make sure that you put at least one day a week aside to just chill. If you are constantly working, you are going to get yourself so stressed. You need to have one day where you just put all the work aside and even if you just do nothing that day, just lie in bed, binge watch on Netflix. Or if you're one of those people who just can't sit still, then I don't know, go out to the zoo, go to the museum, do whatever it is you like, but just set one day aside where your brain is not intensely doing work because otherwise you are going to be so stressed and you just gotta chill. So like I said at the beginning, these are all things that I have found work really great and after a bit of googling and stuff like that, I found that they've worked for so many people and they're so easy to do. So I would really recommend doing them, especially now at this time of year where everyone I know has got deadlines and coursework to do and they've got exams coming up and everyone is incredibly stressed. We just, you know, we just all got to learn to just chill, breathe out, breathe in, it will all be fine. <laughs> so thank you for watching, I hope this helps and I will see you in my next video.